Welcome back to Mecha Warrior 5 Mercenaries. Uh, we're picking up where we left off. We had just completed one of the campaign missions and kind of got our butts kicked a little bit. And I think today we're going to try to take a few side missions and just kind of go from there and do some leveling up. We really would like to find a heavy mech if possible. So let's take a look at our star map and see kind of what's available to us. Let's see. Now we haven't actually crossed over here much kind of scared to. Okay, that's recommended rep 11, so that's probably a little too difficult for us right now. That's 12. This is 6. We're 7, so we can handle something over here. You know, maybe we travel over into this system right here and see what's for sale. Uh, yeah, let's do that. Let's go here, and that'll give us time to repair our mechs, so we'll go ahead and travel. And then we'll look into taking another mission. I know we've got another campaign mission available since we were already Rep 7. So we'll probably be doing that pretty soon, if not in this video. Okay, so we got some rare parts. And what kind of mechs we got here? Let's take a look. Phoenix Hawk. I uh, don't really... Never been a huge fan of a Phoenix Hawk. Um, it feels like too many of the weapon systems are in the arms, so if you lose those, I mean, you're pretty much done. Plus, it can't carry a whole lot. I mean, you got a medium laser, a large laser, another medium laser, and a machine gun. I mean, that's, that's not really bad. Yeah, left arm, left arm, right arm, right arm. So yeah, so if you, if they strip your arms, you have nothing to fight with. So... Well, I think we'll pass on that. Uh, let's see. Do we care about a rare AC5? Burst fire. 6.6 .6 damage versus a regular one, which is 5. I mean, uh, that's kind of cool. It shoots quicker. Less heat. And then this AC20. Now, this is a decent AC20. A lot of money though. I mean, we really don't have anything right now that can use that with the tonnage we have, so I think we'll wait. Let's go back to the star map. Let's see. Um, now there's a rare mech here. So let's let's travel over there real quick. We're gonna we're gonna burn a little bit of money just kind of traveling around. We gotta find something a little heavier than our Shadow Hawk. It's doing good work, but we're going to start taking harder missions, and that's going to make it a little harder if we don't have the armor to back it up. Okay. Oh, a rare Shadowhawk. So what's rare about it? It's just a 2H. Okay, so is it rare because it's the exact... It's in good condition? I mean, it's the exact same one we have. It's got a burst fire AC5. And now there's a Griffin. Those aren't too bad. Let's see, this is the missile. What do we got? Missile and just a PPC, that's it. Okay. It's not bad. Maybe we can do better. Probably should hire another pilot sometime soon. Okay, so this is a 7 cluster. What about... There's a bunch of missions in here. There's a black market. Will these be too difficult for us? Here, let's travel here. It's an assassination contract. Um, let's travel there and see what they've got. Maybe the more the more the difficulty goes up, the better we get with tonnage. Okay, so what do we got in the mech market here? A blackjack, which I really wanted earlier. Um, I still enjoy them. It's a 45 ton. And then the one in, which is basically the same thing we just found earlier. So I think we'll pass. I do like the BJ1, though. Um, I like the AC2s. It's fun to kind of... 
you don't do a lot of damage, but you really uh, shake people's cockpits, and that's kind of cool. Okay, so what contracts we got? So we're targeting independence. That's a 31. That is easier than the last one we did. I think it was a 40. So uh, let's let's try this one. What's uh, what's our tonnage limit? 230. So we can take the other Shadowhawk this time. So let's let's do some money. You know, I think I'm gonna put in as much as I can because we really need some new max, or at least if nothing else, take the salvage and then we sell it. So let's go ahead and accept it. And okay, so what should we drop? We're gonna keep the hunchback in place. And how much tonnage do we have left? Okay, so we've got a good amount, 75. So let's bring in. We do the other Shadowhawk. Oh, I haven't painted it yet. I need to do that still. So you're good with lasers, and you're okay with missiles. And you're decent with missiles. Okay, so. That only puts us to 210, so who's the lightest? We got the Hunchback's the lightest, I think. Yeah, it's a 50 ton. 55. What can we do in place of the Centurion? Is there anything? I think 50 is as big as we get, and I really like it, so I think I think we'll roll with this. We'll have to repaint the uh, other Shadowhawk later. Okay. Yeah, I really want to find a heavy somewhere, you know, a Thunderbolt or cataphract or something. There's a good chance our targets have split up in order to evade us. The more locations on the map are the most likely areas where we'll find them. Be careful, as they have many supporters in the area that are more than willing to die for their cause. Okay, good to know. So, I know in MechWarrior Online the biome makes a huge difference on heat. I haven't had a chance to really notice if it does in this game. Uh, if anyone knows, can you leave a comment? Because um, I've noticed, you know, I'm pretty much running at the, about the same heat every match. And I just wasn't sure if that's something they didn't use in this game, or is that in a DLC or something? It could also be that I'm just blind and not paying attention to it. Which is probably more likely. Okay. So, so far, just some turrets. Slow down a little bit. Okay, another turret. Looks like we got some bad intel. Our target is not here. Let's hope we have better look at the other locations. Target is down! Target destroyed. Oh, don't land on me. It's kind of dangerous shooting those things down. You never know where they're going to fall. Alright, so we've got a got an area over here. I guess we'll head this way. Yeah. Okay, never mind. He's got it. Alright, so here's some vehicles. Well, Alright, team, you're on it today. Comes another one. Alright, now he went back behind cover. Nicely done. Okay, so let's go in here and just look for salvage real quick. I don't see any, but you never know. Now, hey, is that a repair bay? Can I walk up to this? No? I still haven't seen a repair bay in the game. I mean, other than the one mission that makes you use one. Alright, so let's go that way. Alright, I'm stuck. There we go. Alright. So we'll go ahead and head out over this way. Doo -doo -doo. All right, another enemy, Scorpion Light Tank. Did we get him? 
I don't think so. There he is. Oh, wow, nicely done. He's toast. Okay. And let's head over this way. I don't see any salvage. I'm not going to really look for it too hard. Alright. Can I hit it? I hear missiles. I don't think I need to even worry. Yep. Shocker. I'm a little concerned with uh, the lack of mechs. I have a feeling... Ow. Alright, he's down. Another turret. I'm concerned that uh, there's going to be some some big mechs that we have to fight in this because we really haven't seen anything so far. Nearly there, Commander. Ah, salvage. Yeah, I'm not actively looking for it, but if I see it, I'm going to grab it. Excuse me, is there a mech there? All right. What do we get from that? Woohoo. Eh, 10,000's not bad. Every little bit helps. All right, so I guess we go up this way and then to the right. All right, where'd you spot me from? I don't see anything on radar. I know we triggered something. There we go. There's a mech. Almost got his legs. Alright, he's down. Got another vehicle over here. Oh, I missed. Okay. So which way? We have to go that way. So do we go... I guess we go this way and then up and around. I feel like that may be a safer route. Well, we could go up here. Eh, yeah, let's try climbing up here. Yeah. It's not shocking there's something up here. Okay. We're up here. There's an enemy. Turret. Alright, guys, don't rush me. Okay. Now we have two different targets we can go after. I guess we go after this one. Go after the one that's closest and then go over. If you're noticing I have no plan, that's because I have no plan. Okay, so this way? Oh, another turret. There was another turret. Well, I guess, I mean, if we get paid for that, then the more the merrier, I suppose. Okay, so we want to be careful. What do we got going on over there? So we can go over there. Can we go around this rock? Just trying to avoid sliding into a pit that I can't get out of. That could be a problem. Okay, so we're up here. Can I get down there easily? This is the one time that jump jets would be nice. Alright, well, let's see if we can go down. Oh, what a hit. Okay, so we took a little damage, not too bad. You're not punished as bad in this game for 
jumping as you are in MechWarrior Online. You barely uh, touch something and your indicator goes yellow. Alright, so we want to go... I guess we'll go to the right. It's kind of a neat level. All the mountains make you feel like you're kind of close quarters through everything. Alright, we're still getting closer. There's the target, okay. So, are we going to run into a bunch of enemies here? Maybe I should slow down a little and let my team catch up. They're, they're struggling a bit. Come on, guys. There they come. Well, as long as I have the hunchback with me, we're good. And I just saw something pop up. There it goes. All right. Any more salvage? Taking my time. Okay. There's another turret. What kind of turret are you? Yeah, dead one. I imagine there's going to be more. Just kind of waiting out here. Sounds like my team is uh, wrecking things. That's why I take all the damage. They're so slow to catch up to me. Are you serious? Can we just do that? Alright. Well, should we go ahead and go over here? I mean, we didn't even get to look at the base. Why don't we just go over there and look real quick? Alright, because there's turrets, you dummy. That's why. Okay. Just walk up to it there you go, there's one. You know, it'd be cool if the acquisition was like a mech. Package acquired. Ooh, now that's some salvage right there, 51,000. Pretty sure that's the biggest one we've uh, pulled so far. All right, so there's one one location left. The team has turned around. Now we're trudging this way. I mean, I know people have lost technology, at least with the BattleTech and MechWarrior lore, but radar still works. How can you not ID a mech from space? I mean. Well, we have four locations we think he might be in, but he's going to always be in the last one you go to. Okay, well, can we go there first? No, that's not how it works. Gotcha. Of course, I say this, and now watch the next time we have one of these kind of missions. I'm going to end up having to uh, attack something, like, right off the bat. But that would be okay with me. As long as it's not bigger. We are still poor and little. We need all the help we can get. Alright. Well, we are master turret killers. Okay. 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 Let's see what they got. There's four. Alright, so an even fight. We have taken very little damage. I've taken a little bit more than the rest of them. Shocker. Okay, so what's up here? Can we... New target, Centurion. Uh, ooh, I got it. Okay. Laser platforms. Yeah, let's... You guys focus on them. What is that? A quick draw. I wasn't expecting a heavy. That is not cool. I have taken a lot of damage.
And a trebuchet. Yep, yeah, that's what we're trying to dodge. Did we take the quick draw down already? Oh lord, they are right on us. Dragon, this is not... Well, this is some bull right here. Yeah, I know, I know. What do you want me to do? I'm almost down too. We've got a, a dragon, which we weren't expecting. I appear to be missing my laser. All right, he's out. We still have another target. Oh, we still have this little guy. All right, that was way harder. Looks like we got them all. That bounty is ours. Fahad will break open a case of Timbiki Dork when you get back to the ship safely. You mean if? Alright, do we want to go after him? Is it worth it? I mean, that's another mech. Tango down. Okay, good. Let's get out of here. Moving into formation, Commander. Yep, we're not going to go after anything else. We got to get out of here. I lost an arm and almost my engine. I don't mind giving up a laser, but that was a little too close. I was not expecting a dragon and a quick draw. A trebuchet. What else was there? A centurion. Man, the difficulty curve is really out of whack on this game. If I had a heavy, it wouldn't have been so bad, but man. Both Shadowhawks got trashed, which is going to be expensive. And of course, I don't think I took anything for damage insurance, so that's great. It's not the end of the world, but wow, that was a lot harder than I expected. Yeah, but we got some good rep on it. Got an SRM-6, so I mean that's... And of course, what do we get? Do we get any of the mechs we want? No. We get a locust. Wonderful. The game hates me. Alright, well we'll take some, uh... I guess we'll take some of these medium lasers, because, yeah. We lost a few. Well, that was kind of a bust, wasn't it? Yeah, we took out our first heavies, though. So that's nice. At least they weren't assaults. That could have been a lot worse. Okay, that's gonna cost half of what we made. Great. Okay, so before we do anything, I think I want to look at the star map, and it's going to cost a lot. So why don't we travel right here? Yeah, let's go there. And now that we're out of the, the uh, danger zone, we'll assess our mechs and do some repairs, and then see about taking another quick mission. All right, well, we got in the mech market because I want to sell off a locust. Yeah, uh, it's not worth much, but the last time I kind of regretted this, but we have a lot more mechs this time, so I'm, I'm a little less worried about it. So we'll go ahead and sell that. Yeah, 
and if you have anything to buy, just what we sold you, so that's fine. All right, so let's go ahead and redo our repairs real quick. And let's look at my Shadowhawk. Oh, I am in a system that doesn't have the ability to repair. Great. So is there one around here that does? I guess they have to be within... There's a hero mech. All right. Well, let's go there. A hero fire starter. I mean, that's cool. And that wouldn't be a bad mech to have. Oh, but we found our first heavy. And a wolverine. Wolverines aren't bad either. Okay. Well, we got medium laser, medium laser, and ace. Yeah, I think that's... Oh, and then a grasshopper too. I didn't even notice that one. What do we got on here? Uh, LRM5, some lasers, lasers. Yeah, I and mean, that's like a basically our Shadowhawk upgraded. We got 18. Yep, I think we, we buy this one. That'll be a good, good start. The rifleman's pretty cool. That might be, might be worth it too. I'm not sure. I mean, I, I don't have the money for both right now, so I think... I think we take the grasshopper, it's the heavier of the two. Okay, so let's look at what we got here. Alright, so we want to repair my Shadowhawk. Okay, that's not bad. Then he just needs armor, so that's not bad. We need to repaint this one, so let's go ahead and give it the cool paint scheme. Which, uh, there we go. Okay, and we can repair it. And it just lost. Oh, it didn't lose anything, it just has damage to it. Okay, hunchback. This is, nobody shoots at this thing. I mean, I know it doesn't charge in, but man, what a great mech. Okay, so here's our grasshopper. Let's uh, let's take a look at it. So medium laser here, bunch of heat sinks, medium laser, large laser, medium laser, medium laser. So a lot of that, and then it's got some missiles in the head. Well, alarm fives aren't going to do anything, and a bunch of jump jets here. When we put one over here. I don't use jump jets a lot. Okay, so we have a large energy slot there. So we could put a bunch. Let's see, what do we want to go with? Do we want to put just a bunch of medium lasers in with one large and then put them on separate weapon groups? I mean, that's an option. We also have pulse lasers. How many we got of those? One. We've got a lot of lasers though, so I guess we'll. Okay, so there's one. We've got a nicer large laser. Okay, and then those are fine. Heat sinks. Yeah, I agree. Let's put the heat sinks in the torso. We can lose the hand, but not lose the heat sinks. Well, so far this thing's going to run nice and cool. We don't have to worry about that. Probably don't need all these heat sinks, but I think we might actually get rid of a few. Okay, and then we need some missiles. Let's see. All I can do is put in a small one. 9.6 versus 10. That's faster. We're not going to use it a whole lot, so maybe we'll just put a regular SRM4. 
And then we got to put the ammo somewhere, and for whatever reason, all the jump jet slots take up everything, so... Let's, uh, let's put in... Definitely don't want to put it in my chest. Or at least not in the center torso. I guess we'll put it on this side. If it explodes, what do we lose? Just the medium laser? Yeah, that'll work. I mean, uh, 320 rounds, shooting four at a time. We're not going to use them all up. How much is this costing us? No, not bad. It's going to take forever, but... Okay, got to do the other arm. Okay, so what if we max armor? What do we got? We still have tonnage. Okay. Well, that's a large laser. We can't fit large lasers everywhere else. And we are max on armor. Okay, our rear doesn't need that much. Okay. That's good. Well, that gives us a, a little over two tons to play with. What do we do? There's not a whole heck of a lot of things they can put on here. Um, I mean, we don't really need any heat sinks. I guess we could put the jump jets back. But I don't have any more class three, so that's it. We could put another ton of ammo if that's needed, but I don't think it is. Um, let's look at the market real quick. We can't fit any more large lasers because I think that's a medium slot, so... Um, I don't want to put a pulse laser on. I could do some PPCs for long range, but do we really want that? I kind of wish this wasn't in my chest. I wish this was in the arm. That's okay, though. We'll, we'll survive. Any other equipment or anything we can take? I mean, for now, it is what it is. Um, one, two, three, four. So four mediums and one large and then an SRM4. We still have some tonnage left, but... I don't really have a whole lot of other weapons we can put in. These are too big. And we could do the streak, or the stream. Eh, well, we can buy another jump jet. We'll do that. Yeah, we want to buy you. Can we buy you? There we go. Okay. So we ended up putting the jump jets back. And that gets us really close to our tonnage, so... I don't know how else to gain any more than that. I mean, we could shave a little bit and put another half ton of SRM, but I don't really think the SRM is going to be all that usable. I mean, it'll be good up close, but I think I think that's good. All right, so we need some sea bells. So, oh, and we should paint you. For now, we'll keep giving this particular color scheme. I'm probably going to change it up in the future just for variety reasons. Uh, let's look at the star map, and let's do an easy one. Anything that's, you know, five or six. I don't want a multiple contract. What about that one? That's a six. It's got a rare weapon. It's got an assassination contract. I mean, those are fun. That one's got two. There's a defense. There's a demolition. Uh, 13 days. Alright, so let's travel there. Alright, so the hunchback's back. I'm looking forward to getting the grasshopper. Using that, that'll, that'll help. Okay, so what's our timeline look like? So we need seven, six, seven days to get the two Shadowhawks back. So let's just advance the timeline a couple times. That's we can sit here. And we'll go ahead and do that just so we have it available. And we don't need the grasshopper right now. Let's take a contract. Be our shield. Ah, now these look a little bit more our speed right now. Alright, so we get seven shares on that one and six on that one. Yeah, and we don't like 
is it Kurita? Kurita? Um, so, okay, we need some money, so let's put some points in that. I don't think we're going to find anything better than what we have right now. So maybe we'll put some, put a few salvage shares, and then maybe do something like that. How much more do we get if we put it there? Hmm, a good amount. But we are going to get hurt. So we'll do that. Okay, so we'll go ahead and accept this. This is a defense, I think. Okay, we can we can protect. All right, so we're way over tonnage. So this Shadow Hawk gets to go. And let's see, what will we give you? We got to have something with lower tonnage. So are you back in the javelin? Okay, we need to drop ten tons. So we'll take off the Centurion. And actually, you know what? Let's give you the Jenner. And let's give you the Javelin. I think that's the way we used to roll. Or actually, you know what? Let's give you back the, the Vindicator. Oh, we're still 10 over. Hmm. Should I take a short, a smaller one? Uh, I mean, it's 55 tons. I still would have to drop more. I think I'm going to keep mine. Let's, uh, let's take you off the Vindicator. I guess we'll give you the Javelin. That puts us at 170. What are you? You're 35. Do we have anything that's 40? We have 45. Yeah, I see why it's a good idea to have a lot of different mechs, because the tonnage restrictions are kind of stupid. Okay, well, I think this will work. Alright, so let's go. And everybody looks healthy. Okay, so let's go. Converging on the urban outpost marked on your tactical display. We are the only hope these people have, Commander. Let's show them what we can do. We can destroy stuff. Oh wait, this is a defense. Never mind. We We've can save you. Target, Commander. Okay, so I feel like. Happy to have you with us, Commander. Oh, you're cutting it a little short. Enemy forces have already been mobilized and will be here soon. Let's say Moving we want you to go moment, right here. Don't get comfortable. Hostiles have been reported in the area. We're gonna leave one guy back over here. At the waypoint. We have this bad tendency to run through the base and then get surprised by the enemy. Can we come out of this bowl here? Can we climb up this? No. Okay. Well, we know there's enemies coming. Oh, and I just saw something over there. So let's fight them. Am I stuck? I'm stuck. Okay. The intel could be a little better. I wish I knew where the enemies were going to... Like, what kind of terrain this was going to be. I mean, I, it gives you an idea, but... Not the building. Not the building. You fools. Alright, so we've killed one. There's another one out there. I guess I'll be your spotter for now. Alright, there's your mech. And an assassin. Alright, let's go get the mechs. I am not concerned with either of these, really. The assassin can do more damage. And I hear a chopper. A lot of choppers. Okay. I didn't get him. I missed that too. Okay. Alright, got an enemy coming up on me. Gotta take care of this guy. Uh, 
All right, this locust is about down. Okay. I see you there. Maybe I can get him to come after me. New target assassin. Yeah. We ended up using a lot of missiles this time around. Hey, buddy. Alright. His legs are almost gone. Took off one. We really need to get in there and get those... Yeah. It's been breached just because he ran away from us. He's down. Okay, we're still doing good. Both max. Looks like there's a... Both? Not sure what you want from me, dude. I don't have a jet. I can't just fly over there. Four... found the targeted asset. Move up to it, and we'll begin the recovery procedure. All right. We have time, real quick. That's close enough. Ready to start pickup operation. Okay. Excellent find, Commander. Beginning recovery now. Hey, eight thousand seven hundred. That's not bad. All right, we gotta get rid of these VTOLs. I just have not had an opportunity. They're not good doing them a whole heck of a lot. They're just kind of sitting there. So we'll just we'll just come over here and start. Picking them off. Wow. Uh, okay, no, I got him. I was like, say, that's a uh, strong helicopter. Well, we knew they would do that. Got 11 enemies left on the board. I know there's something over here. Yeah, light tank. So, we're going to push out over here a little bit. Oh, are you stuck? There we go. Sorry, my dude. Okay. Locust and Shadowhawk. So Shadowhawks are... Now, I left a mech over there. Is he gonna defend? And why did we lose... Okay, I was like, we lost radar for a minute there. That was weird. Okay, they're on the outside of the bowl. So maybe if I can take them off over here. Enemy mech ahead. Yeah, we're coming. I'm not worried about dying to these. Okay. Well done. Let's come over here. Where are the mechs? I don't see them. I know they, there they are. What are they doing out there? Just kind of hanging out with each other. Well, if you're gonna sit there, I'm just gonna kind of pelt you while the hunchback does some work on you. Hey, you have a PPC. How do you like this? Alright, and we got him? No. Well, you've taken a lot of damage. There we go. And you... Inbound. 
How are we doing on missiles? Getting a little low. Oh, he, he, he juked me. Alright. Alright, Hunchback, take him out. Nice. All right, Cicada, Firestarter. Uh, Cicada just has lasers, I think. So let's go after the Firestarter. We've still got the Javelin over there. All right, go ahead and start pelting them. Come on, we want to target this guy. There's one arm. Not too worried, I'm not very hurt. I know we're low on ammo, gotta be careful. Okay, where's the last one? Uh, there you are. Now we've got some choppers still over there, so we'll gotta go take care of them. Base is looking okay. If I can get this guy before he gets in there and does too much damage. So far, he's just running around in there. Yep. Don't hit the base, don't hit the base. Oh, I missed. All right, let's, can we get these choppers while they're just sitting here? Okay, so what's left? Just the mech. All right, guys. This is not where we want to be fighting, though. Oh, we used them all. Okay. Well done, Commander. The area 76. That's probably our best yet. The area is taking a beating, Commander. Don't give them the opportunity to cause any more harm. Well, the beating was us. I'm really afraid to ask what that sound is. Sounds like it's hailing. <laughs> okay, got some rep. Okay, well we definitely didn't get enough for the Shadowhawk. Um, which, you know, would have been kind of cool, but I don't think we really need it. I think we're, we're past that now. So I got the Locust, and let's take another laser. Okay. And we got some good money off that, though. That'll kind of help recoup the repair costs from earlier. None of us did any... We didn't have any major damage done against us, so... Not bad. What other contracts we got here? Uh, Targeting House Steiner. Alright, well, maybe next time. I think that was pretty good. We got a... Got a, a big mech. We'll get to try that out next time. Hopefully. Alright, if you like this video, please like, comment, and subscribe.